Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the vlog. Um, as you can tell by my voice, I have not been great health-wise. Um, I actually, after my first vlog in London, I ended up coming down with a sinus infection for about two weeks. It is still going on, um, as in like, it's still like in my body, but I don't feel as bad. So we will be back to exploring London. Um, I'm sorry for the lack of vlog before. Uh, yeah, it was not exciting. It was just me in my room. Today is a new day. Um, it's actually the last day that uh, Nick is here with me um, before he goes off to Florence and I move him into Florence for his study abroad semester. Um, and so it's our last day in London together. And I think we are going to just explore maybe go to Portobello Road Market, go to a museum, um, see what we get up to. It's a nice day outside today, so I'm excited. And then this weekend, I will be heading off to Florence to help him move in for like literally two days or something. And then I'll be back here for a little bit. Um, and I will probably see you again then, just for some continuity of London in this vlog. But yeah, uh, I'm excited to feel okay again. I'm excited to take you around, um, see some new parts of the city because I really, I think I've gotten to see some new neighborhoods a little bit, but mostly um, still it's a little unfamiliar. So let's go. everyone it is the evening now after an amazing day um just hanging out <laughs> we ended up getting really good pho that i forgot to um film i'm pretty sure uh overall we got to see a lot of cool places um portobello road market is always so fun and we also got to see the vna it's a good last hurrah for london for nick and then tomorrow we have a stuff name flight to catch to florence um so yeah, it's packing Bonanza from now for the next couple of hours, and hopefully we can get a little bit of sleep. But I will probably not vlog too much in Florence, um, other than just like some clips here and there. Um, so I will see you when I am back in London next week. But I hope you enjoyed coming around today. Uh, I definitely enjoyed taking you along with me. And yeah, here's to better health and better vibes and more exploring. Um, and I will see you soon. Good night.
Hi everyone, welcome back to sunny London and my laundry in my room. Um, yeah, I am back in London for about two days before going back to Italy for my reading week. Um, it basically, I bought the flights separately before realizing there was a reading week, so it ended up being a little weird, and so I'm just in London for two days, um, like a little stopover for class. But um, today is a really beautiful day, and I have just had an online class this morning, made some lunch for myself, and then I think my friend Shalva and I are going to head out to um, a cafe that is in a church um, that I'm really excited to go to. Then I have another class today, um, and then dinner with a friend, and um, I, yeah, that should be all for today. I am also trying to simultaneously pack for my like week-long trip for a good time, not for a long time, so. I'll see you at the cafe. from dinner I called Mindy I had tutoring um, and another call and it is around 11 p.m. it is officially the end of my day I don't think I'm gonna do any other work today other than maybe watching a movie that I'm supposed to watch for my classes it's been a good busy day I am going to get comfy and ready for bed and just like in a more relaxed mode I'm realizing like I know a lot of this is not like rocket science, but um, sort of really the separation of like morning, day, and then night is like um, just so nice and having sort of like morning time and night time, even if you don't have like a set routine, um, changes a lot. So I think just to sort of mentally separate my space and time, um, I'm going to set up sort of like my night lights and uh, then I will listen to a nice little song um, and that'll sort of like be my cleanse for the day. I think I'm just going to uh, hang out, yeah, watch some videos, um, call my family, things like that. So should be a pretty simple night. <laughs> It is Wednesday. It is um, my last day in London for about a week and a half. Um, I'm about to head to Florence, back to Florence tonight um, for my reading week and just gonna hang out there um, with Nick. And then um, at the end of my reading week, I will be traveling back to Paris to see my friend Gaia um, who's there and also just to revisit some old places. Um, so yeah, today I think I'm going to just take it slow, uh, have sort of a calm solo morning, and then I'm meeting a friend for uh, coffee before I head off to the airport. One of the funniest things about living in London, or like just this semester, has been like having to cook for myself um, because we have like a communal kitchen. I'm obviously not with like a host family. Yeah, it's been very interesting because eating out in London is so expensive that I really try to only keep it to like special occasions or like meeting people. Um, and so other than that, it's me in the kitchen. And that results in days like today where um, because I like didn't want to get any groceries for like two days, I got porridge, Korean style porridge from the local Asian market and just heat it up in the microwave. Um, yeah, my unglamorous lifestyle. 
Mm. Yeah, cooking for myself has been really interesting. It's hard to get yourself to do like more glamorous meals. And so I've just been doing simple, simple, simple. And sometimes after a lot of simple, you're like, I crave like all, you know, the food that your parents would make or something like that. Anyways, um, a little cookie chat and I think I'm going to finish breakfast. Um, I'm gonna get ready and head over to a cafe just to do some work um, and some writing. And then yeah, uh, it should be a pretty good day. It's just been so sunny here for the last two days. Um, so I'm really enjoying it, um, feeling healed by the sun. And I hope you are having a lovely morning, afternoon, evening, night, wherever you are. Um, and I will see you in a sec. I had was that porridge this morning and this sandwich is literally saving me oh my gosh it's absolutely delicious it's from uh, a place called king of falafel uh, i'm not really sure what street it's on but it's i think in like the bloomsbury area and yeah and as you can see it is amazingly sunny in my room so just enjoying the sun eating some food before i meet a friend um and then yeah i think it's off to the airport after that um it was such just the best morning um yeah i just really missed like spending time alone in the city where i feel like really energized and it's a little bit more of a quiet quiet morning and i get to do all the things that i really enjoy great time great food feeling really good i hope i got to share a bit of that energy with you um i'll take you along to uh tea with my friend and then I think um, that'll be the end of this London vlog and hopefully the start of a Florence one in Italy.